amphetamine versus methamphetamine. What's the difference? What's the difference? These drugs can bring on similar effects when misused, but they have big differences that you need to know about. Amphetamines and methamphetamine are both stimulant drugs. They speed up the information traveling between your brain and the rest of your body. The National Institute on Drug Abuse says that in the short term, both can make you feel intense pleasure or happiness, more active and talkative, and less hungry. Amphetamines and methamphetamine have some key differences, though. What are amphetamines exactly? There are a class of stimulant drugs that doctors may prescribe to treat conditions like narcolepsy, obesity, and ADHD. Some common prescription amphetamines are Adderall, Dexedrine, and Vyvanse. Amphetamines can be legally taken when prescribed by your doctor. They're not legal if you take them without a prescription. Misusing them as a study aid or to get high can lead to addiction and overdose and other health problems. What is methamphetamine? Also known as ice on the streets. What is methamphetamine? This drug's chemical structure is similar to amphetamines. In rare cases, doctors prescribe legally made methamphetamine to help treat ADHD and obesity. But it's far more common for people to take illegal street versions of this stimulant. Meth, or crystal meth, is a dangerous drug that you can smoke, snort, swallow, or inject. It can hurt your health in a number of ways soon after you take it. And if you keep using it, you'll be more likely to have long-term problems. Methamphetamine is more potent than amphetamines. The National Institute on Drugs Abuse says, At similar doses, much more of it gets into your brain, and the damage it does to your central nervous system is more harmful and long-lasting. Meth is very similar to other amphetamines, but has one key structural difference. That is, it, it goes into your brain faster than other stimulant drugs. Meth causes you to feel an intense high very quickly. Due to this difference, more people seek to abuse meth rather than stimulants like Adderall. Meth and amphetamines both hold Schedule II controlled substance categorization by the DEA. However, doctors prescribe amphetamines for specific conditions. When all is said and done, thanks for watching, and as always, ciao everyone, until next time. Sources, info, and content credit goes to the following. Once again, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and until next time. Ciao.